I can do, sir, please. Don't do this to my wife, man. You don't know what you're doing to my family, man. Please. I'm begging. I'm literally begging. Where am I going to put my feet? Sir, I'm begging you, please. Please. That is not a crime, and you're telling me to get out of my vehicle. Do you know where Lieutenant Mingus is right now? So, no, he's not in the building? I don't know. I'm not. What do you know? I'm not telling you nothing else until I find out who's driving that vehicle. You not a supervisor, bro. I need somebody higher than you right now. Uh, if you didn't know, I went to the police academy and they kicked me out. Spit in my face. Today's video takes us to Sheridan, Colorado, where we find Puddin' Pie, aka Little Chrissy Boy, as he gets arrested once again. How many more times does this guy have to get arrested? Shouldn't he already be in jail? Isn't that appeal about up? Oh, well, I don't know. Let's all sit back, watch, have a good night, but most of all, <laughs> enjoy! So I just wanted to let you guys know uh, we're live because I got arrested. As you can tell by the thumbnail, you can tell by the title of the video. Um, of course, we got shameful Sheridan at it again. And they, they just completely can't stand me. They'll do anything they can to retaliate against me. It's just ridiculous, guys. So uh, basically, let's just break it down real quick. We're going to play a, a short clip of the actual arrest. But uh, what happened essentially is I have some guys here that well, I wanted to take cop watching, right? So we go out cop watching and of course we're in the city of Sheridan and one of the guys decides that it'd be a good idea to flash his flashlight at the cops. Yeah, little Chrissy, that doesn't sound like such a good idea. Cops don't like flashlights in their eyes and neither does anybody else. But frauditors are stupid. Oh, pardon me, I call them anarchists now. Yeah, anarchists are just as dumb as frauditors because they all belong to the same family. Stupid. And so I don't really think much of it. I mean, it's not illegal to do that. So, of course, he's flashing them at a Sheridan guy as the Sheridan guy is parked on the side of the road. And, of course, he hits his reds and blues on me. So getting pulled over. And we didn't break the law. Nothing's illegal about that. So pulled over and immediately roll your window down all the way and let me see your ID and get out of the car. So I get out of the car and the guy immediately arrests me just because he knows it's me. They know my, what my truck looks like. So immediately arrested, guys, right off the bat. And I wasn't even the one who was flashing the flashlight. He did no investigation, right? He just assumed it was me, bam, in handcuffs, and out you go. Well, that's what happens when you are a civil rights activist or a so-called civil rights activist, I should say. You got a real smart ass mouth, but you got a pretty mouth too. Wait till Bubba gets a hold of you. He'll have you washing his drawers every day. Cause Bubba gonna like you. He gonna love you a long time. You're just a short little bitch, aren't you? So, oh, hold on one second guys. It's because it was me flashing the flashlight at him. <laughs> <laughs> What's up folks? You don't know me. I'm not really here. This is an AI generated image. My voice is not real. But boom, it was me flashing the flashlight every single time, officers. <laughs> Yourselves. How about that? I reached all the way out from Arizona and I tickled your little buttholes and you arrested the wrong person, stupid. I did it every time. I did it. And I'm proud of it. And I recorded it. Oh, wait, hold on a second. It's Jim's turn. To I'm the one that recorded him flashing the flashlight at all the cops. <laughs> With friends like these two yahoos, who needs enemies? One guy flashes the light, and the other guy records it. And who takes the fall? Little Chrissy. Yeah, man, you need to rethink your friend list, bro. <laughs> It's so ridiculous that they didn't do any investigation whatsoever. They just didn't like him and they knew it and they wanted to take him to jail and they wanted to, to make him suffer. That was the entire point of that stop. We were irritating them. The, the, his, this truck was irritating them. They were going after the guy they knew that drove that truck, even though 
it was painfully obvious that it, I mean, it was obvious you did you shouldn't have had to investigate. It was painfully obvious that it wasn't the driver flashing the flashlight. It was coming out the passenger side in the back. I All mean, right, guys. So, and then, and then bring us so basically, I if you guys pay attention to my videos, you guys know that I've been, you know, hinting that we got some people coming out here. So that's the big surprise here. See, I got the T-shirt. Go check out your uh, Direct D merch. I'll leave the link in the description of this video. It's actually oh, yes, indeed. Go ahead and conspire with known criminals, guys that have done hard time. Doesn't Direct D still have a warrant out for his arrest? Oh, maybe that's why he's in Colorado, because he's wanted in Arizona? Who knows? I can't keep up with all these yahoos. The quality on like Teespring. It's, it's not like Teespring, guys. So this is like won't wash out in one wash. So if you buy stuff from my Teespring store, like the Teespring, if it washes out, like logo washes out in one wash, you can email them. They'll send you another shirt. And then if it still washes out, you can email them again and they'll just give you a complete refund. That's what I do because uh, they, I sample all my merch. And so um, I just do that and I just, ba you basically get it for free essentially. But um, I will be sometime soon switching out of Teespring and going to something more quality like this. So, but, so we're going to go ahead and get into this a little bit. Um, right. Let's bring up the guests that we got going on here. Play the most powerful 30 second video. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you should play in that little video. So this is the team right here, guys. DMA, DD, and Jim Freedom in the house. Oh, yes, indeed. This is perfect. Hanging around with thugs. You'll really be in the slammer hanging around with these guys. They'll teach you all the ins and outs of what to do once you get arrested and you have to go in there and grab your ankles, bend over, and cough. You know, Chili talks about that all the time. It must be an exhilarating experience. And, uh, yeah, so you, should we just jump into the video real quick? That's probably what they yeah, want to see. Yeah, show them so, the crux of what happened. This is not going to be um, the full video, guys. This is just a teaser, just kind of let you guys know what's going on here. So let's just jump right into it. Get ready. All right, let me just make sure that that's playing. Let's go ahead and go full screen. There we go. This is kind of a little teaser what happened. 16-3-102 to commit a crime. Well, lock your door and open your door. That's how many times I've asked. Should I get out of it? Should I get out? Could you break your window? I'm going to get out. Should we get out with him? Thank you. Oh, I'm under arrest. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not one of those other officers that you play with all the time, okay? Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, poor little pudding pie. Oh, he ought to be used to the position, though. He bends over all the time, doesn't he? Hey, let's look at a couple more videos where little Chrissy was arrested. Roll that clip. Hey, Hello, everyone. Hey, Sydney. Your stuff? We'll Which? You want to show me? Can you tell me what I'm going to do? What's the warrant for, Mitchell? For what? Hold on. Hold on. It takes yeah. all your yeah. issues yeah. for this. Yeah. Are you going to take your stuff? Um, yeah, I'm going to take your stuff. Leave right. your stuff there. Okay. <laughs> Just a moment. James, Mitchell, 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 Wait, we're not gonna, they're not gonna tell you what the warrant's for? Well, explain that. Can I get ready my tea? Step back. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So apparently from what I can gather, Sweet Tea pictured here. I don't know who that is in relationship to Denver Metro Audits. And little Chrissy here, also known as Puddin' Pie were arrested on warrants, but nobody seems to know what the warrants are all about. Oh, poor little Chrissy and poor little Sweet Tea. Oh, I tell you what. And that loudmouth you hear in the background, she's dropped at least half a dozen F-bombs in 30 seconds. You got to take them out or you can't monetize it. Now, I guess she doesn't care if it's monetized. But that's Regan. Yeah, supposedly his big sister... I think that's his mama. Oh my god, you guys are so fucking dramatic. Holy fuck. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
Nothing but tyrants, guys. It's super tyrannical. Yeah. Super tyrannical, guys. Watch your back. Yeah, watch your back. Oh my God, watch your back. You're stealing your soul from the camera. You're stealing my soul with your camera. Anyway, guys, it's yeah. unnecessary a uh, use of force there, officer. Oh, yeah. Unnecessary use of force. Ah, oh, look at little Chrissy being led away like he's a common criminal. Well, I guess if you think about it, he really is a thug, isn't he? Yeah, he stands up for what? What does he stand up for? Oh, that's right, nothing. Yeah, he stands up for nothing. He just likes those clicks and views and all that money he makes on YouTube because, remember, he's a jailbird. He can't get a regular job. What's he going to put on his application? Have you ever been uh, convicted of a crime? Well, yes, I have. Yeah, well, sorry, we can't give you the job, sonny boy. Cowards, cowards! Jesus Christ. Eight cops. I don't know who this guy is. Anybody identify him and let me know in the comments section. Whoever he is, he's calling the police cowards. I could never figure that out. How are the police cowards by doing their job? That makes them a coward. It would seem to me that police are rather brave because they go to work every day. They don't know if they're going to come home. Yeah, so this guy here is the coward. Yeah, whoever he is, he's a coward. Wow. Well, now there you have it, folks. Little Chrissy and his friend Sweet Tea taken away just like they're common criminals. Well, like I said, if you think about it, they really are, aren't they? Now, while we're on the subject today, let's go ahead and watch a triple feature. And if I can find another one, it'll be a four-banger. Well, let's watch this one and I'll have another good laugh, shall we? I think you need to get a life, man. I'm not in here filming people in the Colorado Springs Utilities. I think I've got a life. I wasn't even filming people. I came in and immediately got approached by this guy. Yeah, yeah. I, mean, I, asked you I didn't even get to film, do my tour of this area here, hey, man. Everyone's entitled to their privacy. This guy right here just freaking grabbed me. Allegedly. If that's a grab, man, you are really a loser. Dude, you tried to grab my camera out of my hand, I man. I moved your camera from, from my face. No, you grabbed my hand, man. Jeez. It's people like that. Oh, did you hear little Chrissy? He said, I didn't even get to do my tour yet. Well, this is a 40-minute live stream, so you know we're going to have to cut it up big time. I can't stand to listen to five minutes of this guy, let alone 45, so let's get going. He's escalating the customers now. Yeah, tell him that he grabbed my camera, man. I moved your camera because I wanted to have a conversation. Okay. When I talk Thank to you people, for admitting like look, it. When I talk to people, I like to look them in the eye. Look at him. Look at I him, guys. You're... Look how close he is to me. Look at look. When I talk to people, I like to look them in the eye. I know you don't have the balls to do that, so you stand behind this camera. It's like your shield. Mm -hmm. yeah, is that what you do? Okay. This is your shield? No, it's not my shield. This I came is, in here. Is this your story, blanket? Man. Is this your blanket? What? Are, why are you so close to me? What are you doing? This is the, the well, example you're setting for your well, kid. If I right get now? a little further, you put that shield in front. You just spit on my eye, man. Back up, off, out of my space. Or what? You leave? Yeah. Tell if me. If you don't like it, you leave. There he is. I mean, if I don't like it, leave. He's got his shield in front of him again. What is pacifier? This guy. This guy. Oh, little Chrissy, you're being punked, roasted, dice sliced, and set out to dry. Oh, I like this. You know, lately people aren't taking this crap from frauditors. It's about time. Yeah, man. I you, you better hope that the cops don't come because I'm going to press charges on you, man. That's harassment. Are you? CRS 18-9-111, cool. unwanted yeah. touching. You can't put your hands on people, man. What about unwanted filming? 
There is no such thing as unwanted okay. filming. I didn't man. touch you, by the way. Yes, you did. You just admitted it on camera no, that you I moved that you, your camera. So there you, you go. The face. Yeah, you touched my camera, which is an extension of me. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Well, you you we can't grab. Them? What if I just like grab? Press charges. Let's just we wait. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead, man. Yeah. I said I'm not. I'm a cop what are caller. Your damages? I'm what not are your a damages? cop caller, but. What are your damages? There doesn't have to be damages for harassment. Yeah. When you come up and just grab someone's stuff like that. Then you just filming. That's. That's, without, my, yeah. without my consent. Yeah, but what law is it that I can't record in a public space? Well, I'm not, I'm not a lawyer, and I'm not. Okay, yeah, clearly. Yeah. I mean, did because I, you're trying did, to tell me that. advertise those lawyer? Are but you you're trying lawyer? to tell me that I can't record are in you, a public space. Are you a lawyer? I didn't say you can't record in a public space. I said I don't want you to record me without my consent. Well, you. But that's how little Chrissy makes a living, sir. Matter of fact, he just published his earnings recently. Let's take a look at those real quick. Oh yeah, there was a subpoena from the court to look at his earnings from YouTube, and they're pitiful. Oh, $11,580 over five months. Man, that's not very much money, little Chrissy. I thought you were doing better than that, boy. Started a conversation with me while I'm recording, so of course I'm going to document. To he made a comment to you, he didn't start You were talking. talking to me, you asked me why I'm in here. I asked you what your problem is. Yeah. And you haven't answered that. Yeah. I don't have a problem. My problem is you right now, yeah. who's harassing me. Okay. That's my problem. Yeah, you can leave your life, like you feel like you're getting mistreated in some yeah. way. You know, yeah. but, you know? Yeah. who knows what this guy's up to. I'd like to have a conversation with him, but he can't have a conversation. Conversation? That's yeah. I'm the one that can't have a conversation. I I turned around to have a conversation with you, and you walked up, got one inch from me, and then you grabbed my camera, man. No, now I, I had to go live. Camera. I didn't grab your camera. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. Grab you, your yeah, you did, and you had told no, me you did. I tried to. I tried to get the shield. From okay. So that were semantics now, man. <laughs> so the gentleman begins to walk away, and I thought it was all over. Boy, was I wrong. I'm going to have to lower the volume on this next clip because you two will never approve of all this yelling. Hey, I've asked you, how many times have I asked you to stop filming me? Get out of my space. How many times? I will defend wait, myself. Wait you, this is your this warning. Is your I will space? defend myself. This is your and I have space? this on camera. You're on a, live on the okay. internet right now, man. So you're saying Do this not is touch your space? Me. You're, by coming you? up into my space with the intent to alarm or annoy, that is harassment, no, sir. I'm asking you a question. I'm Why are you getting question. so close to me? I was in this building way before you were. It doesn't matter if you were here first, man. You approached me You're and got space. right in my you face. You are filming me. Yeah. I consider that harassment. I, this is actually, you know, you're going to say my protection or my shield. Yes, I'm documenting this now because okay. you've already committed a, a crime so far. <laughs> you're harassing me right so you're now. you're documenting this harassment? Yes. Okay. So you're documenting a threat to me. You said, you, you, what did you just say? You threatened me? Back up out of my space, man. Why are you so close to me? If This is good stuff, isn't it? You can't make this stuff up. I wonder why the security guards aren't stepping in and saying something. Perhaps they're too busy calling the popo. Well, we'll find out soon enough. Let's carry on. You don't like how close we are. How about you back up? See, see what you're doing right there, man? You're, like I said, you're live on the internet. How about you back up? You're lit I never approached you. You approached me. I would, I'm, I, this is where I want to be right now. So, so you want to be? You want to be? Is this a problem? Is this a problem? Let's look how close he is, guys. So you can see my three feet. feet. Three, three feet. Three feet. That's like a foot and a half, man. Okay. Foot. Why would you go stand a foot and a half from me? Because I'm trying Let's to get on the live stream too. How close he is. So you got 284 people in here watching you act like that, man. Don't do drugs. This is what happens when you do drugs. Okay. And this is what happens when you don't get a job. Are you still filming with me without yeah. consent? I'm yeah, I don't need your consent to record in a public space, man. Here he comes again, guys. I'm asking you to stop. I'm asking you to stop filming. I'm Little Chrissy got the right one today. Well, I just can't tell you how happy this makes me. Yeah, there's more and more people standing up to these frauditors because they realize they're a bunch of clowns. What are they going to do? Oh, you touched my camera. Oh, you're standing too close to me. Are those arrestable offenses? Absolutely not. But little Chrissy is going to take a trip today, aren't you, little Chrissy? Let's roll that clip. I'm asking you to stop filming. Do you just not have enough respect for your fellow citizens to, to honor their request? Are you just a troll? You're a troll. That's 100% what you are. You're a troll. That guy knows it. This guy that thinks guy, he's going to get, he's going to intimidate me. You're a troll. And you're not going to deny it because you know you're a troll. I'm a troll? Yeah, you're a troll. Okay. Don't touch my camera, man. What are you doing? I did Gosh, not touch your camera. Gosh, man. 
Dude, you get triggered really easy. Yeah, you know what? I don't like it when people come up and get right in my face and try to intimidate me. I don't like when people film me when I've asked them not to. Why do you get triggered? Because so I have the right to record in this Why do you area, get triggered so and you don't have the right to come up hey, and intimidate. Can you ask me a question? What makes you get triggered so easy? Is that just because I don't? Because you're obviously an unstable man, and I don't know what you're going to do. That's I'm why I'm triggered. Oh yeah, a lot, so we're gonna I'm unstable. Doing that. I don't get triggered nearly. All right, guys. So we are at the Colorado Springs Public Utility here in Colorado Springs. Is it like, like the pot calling the kettle black? Little Chrissy, this man's not triggered, but you clearly are. Of course, I think you're a good actor. You're trying to get the maximum clicks and views before you go to prison. Yeah, you got to make that money. So when you uh, go to prison, you have some money in your commissary, huh? I understand. If, uh, if some moderators want to throw some information in the chat, they said the police are on their way. This man already harassed me. No, I, I asked got in my face. You, you grabbed my camera. You admitted it. I, no, I didn't grab your camera. I, well, I, you I tried to move your shield away so yeah. I could look at you and have a conversation. Okay, thank you for admitting that on camera, man. So why are you so triggered? Is there a reason? I told you why. Are you having a bad Because day? I have some strange man demanding that I stop recording, and then you got one inch from my face I'm and tried to intimidate me? just having a conversation, trying to have a conversation. That's what you call a conversation, by getting one inch from someone? Hey, I came in here perfectly polite, He's not trying to have a He's problem with a anyone. Troll. He's just a troll. He's just a troll. Have a good day, sir. And then we have this guy, John Hunter, an allied security, of course, who immediately came up. And see, you're the one that started this fire. If you would have came job. in, just doing my if job. you would have came doing in. Doing my job. Doing my job. Okay. Doing my job. Can I talk? Or are you going to just cut you me off? You can talk, but I'm not listening anymore. Okay. Well, I mean, I can talk. You don't have to listen. Well, good people, we're going to have to speed it up just a tad because little Chrissy's going to cry and stomp and have a temper tantrum because this man violated his rights some kind of way. I don't know what's wrong with these fraudsters, especially little Chrissy. I can't wait till he takes a trip to the big house. Everybody with me on that, right? Ten minutes later. I'm going to keep the camera on whoever I want, bro. You're not the boss of me, man. This guy, man, thinks he's going to tell me what to do. Mr. John Hunter from Allied Security. So if you're just coming in, guys, the police are on their way. Uh, Mr. John Hunter from Allied Security uh, immediately came up to me and got right in my face and told me I can't record in here because people have personal information. And then that caused a spark, sparked a reaction that a customer got right in my face and he hit my camera away and he got one inch from me trying to intimidate me, man. Little Chrissy should stick to his religious channel. He's a lot better at that than he is at this. 222, 333, 444, and so on and so forth. Uh, let's skip ahead a little bit more. 11 minutes later. Are you Mr. Williams? No, I'm not Mr. Williams. I'm covering him down here. Williams is the guy that called you. He's the supervisor of Colorado Springs Security. Okay. You're not Mr. Williams either. No. So, Mr. Williams is one of our upper sensitive guys who calls you guys. Uh, this gentleman's in here recording and asking to stop and leave. Okay. Refusing to leave. He's not here for actual business, and this is actual business, so he's disrupting business. Okay. We're going to leave. Uh, he was very clear that he said he was not going to leave unless he was arrested and put in handcuffs. So, I would like him to leave. It's not trespassing. Whatever we got to do. Okay. okay. Is your preference for him to leave? Or okay. So, all right. Professor, I'm Corporal Wilbury. I'm a Colorado Springs police officer. Um, the gentleman in charge of the buildings made it clear that you're not welcome here. Oh, excuse me, officer, but that would violate the lad's First Amendment right to freedom of the press, not to mention his freedom of speech. And now, my goodness, he has to be able to redress his government. Oh, it just violates the First Amendment all around, sir. Um, this is what's called public-private, so it's open to the public. You can come in, you can conduct business. Um, if you don't have a reason to be here and you're not conducting business, they can ask you to leave at that point, okay? You're the um, corporal? Yes. Okay. Um, he's made it clear that you're no longer welcome here if you've finished the business. So I'm going to give you, it is now 147. I'll give you till 150 to leave the premises, okay? So, okay? 
Well, uh, before you go, uh, let me just explain to you that you, you no. don't know that I, oh, can I talk? I, I didn't interrupt you the whole time. I let you say your whole thing. Let me respond to you, okay? The 150 is, is a hard deadline, okay? okay? I want so you I, to understand you're using I, I your understand time. that. We can continue the conversation on the sidewalk if you like. Okay. So uh, you're interrupting my time, so. Notice how little Chrissy wants to interrupt the officer. I listened to you, now it's my turn. A sure sign of a narcissistic, sociopathic behavior, no doubt. And little Chrissy also suffers from the Napoleon complex. What is he, about five foot four? Well, let's give him a couple inches. Five foot six, yeah. Yeah, but he suffers. Oh, just a little baby boy. I don't know what happened to his live stream. It just skipped ahead. I don't know. Maybe he's got some faulty equipment. But I'm going to fix it. Don't worry. Let's continue. You're a corporal, man. You look like you're a pretty seasoned officer here. And you don't understand that you, you don't have... Uh, 49. You don't understand that you can't trespass from public property? You don't understand that? You don't understand that you can't trespass from public property unless I commit a crime? Corporal? It's 150. You are now being detained for the crime of trespass. I'm going to okay. issue you a citation. Set the camera down. Put your hands behind your back. Okay, hold on. Let me just move this. Get this so that it doesn't get messed up. All right, guys, I'm getting arrested right now. Yeah. Little Chrissy is so thoughtful to keep his viewers informed. Okay, guys, I'm getting arrested now. Right, right, right. Thank you so much for that update, little Chrissy. He's putting me in handcuffs. Put your hands behind your back. Would you like me to carry your camera for you? Yes. I'm going to double lock these so they don't tighten up. What are you here? I know. I mean, I'm going to go out to my car. We'll be receiving a summons for trespass, okay? Okay. You just made a big mistake, man. You're going to be sued. You understand that, right? Qualify, you're not going to get qualified immunity for this. I'm going to have to sue you personally for arresting me and violating my rights. You swore no to protect my rights, man. Why would you do that? Did you call one I did. Why would you Why would you swear no to protect my rights and then violate my rights like that? We're going to go on and on. Nobody cares about your rights, little boy. Matter of fact, you have the right to remain silent. Use that right. Hey, maybe you can call AFA and Leroy Truth. They'll help bail you out. Well, folks, there's nothing else to see in this video. He just gets walked out to the police car, and then the video cuts off. Oh, man, this is what happens, little Chrissy, when you think you know everything, but you really know nothing. Oh, man, when is your sentencing? Isn't your sentencing later this month? That's going to look real good, no doubt. The judge is going to love that. He's going to give you the maximum on top of the maximum. Well, not to worry, good people, if you enjoy watching stupid people do stupid things on my channel, please subscribe. <laughs> As always, thanks so much for stopping by, little Chrissy. Better call your mama. Cheers to that. I've actually studied English, and uh, I have a, over a 400-level education in English. I'm not sitting down. I refuse to sit down. I refuse. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. What are you gonna do about it? Nothing. Nothing. You can come try to make me. You're welcome to try to make me. Take a swing. Take a swing. What is the reason for calling the officers here? Oh, no I'm reason. Really, has... I'm really, I'm really unhappy that somebody did this to me. I'm gonna arrest you for trespassing in a minute. On public property? Yeah. We're asking you to leave, and you're not leaving. That's trespassing. She's, oh, she's right in my face, guys. You can't t come up and touch me like that. You don't have permission to film me in any space. I don't need permission to, yes, to you record do. you in public, man. Actually, no, that's the law. Do. Oh, is that like a law? It's against the line. Oh, what law is that? Funny, because I've never heard about that. I pay for that uniform, I pay for that car, I'm the taxpayer, right? You work for me, right? You're just a little guy. You're just a little guy. You work for me. You are a public servant. You are a public servant. You work for me.